With another episode of, hey, I'm just asking. And today, we want to talk about um, Brittany Griner. Free for Russians arms dealer. Wow. Let's start the debate. Now, first of all, let me say. I'm glad that she's home. She gets to spend the holidays with her family. But to me, this is just like another smack in the face from America. Like, let's talk about the situation first. Okay, we have an athlete, right? She goes to Russia. With marijuana, marijuana or um, CBD cartridges or whatever the case may be, it's illegal in Russia. Now, Brittany Griner, WNBA, I think she went to uh, Baylor College. So she has to have some knowledge that this is not legal in Russia. Like, it's no way, unless she was high. Right? And then I say that to say this. I don't want to make it so much about her, but I got to talk about it so I can get to my point. Now, she goes over there, she gets caught, she gets locked up. And I say that, do you know how many Americans have been locked up on American soil for the same thing before they made marijuana legal here? But then for America to cry out to have her released is crazy. And I say that because for her to get released, you had to free a Russian arms dealer. Was that a fair trade? Someone that sold death can actually be pardoned. Who probably, his guns probably killed thousands, hundreds, maybe millions. We don't know. But he was pardoned to bring Brittany Griner home. This is where I get confused because we have plenty political prisoners, those Black Panthers, Larry Hoover, that they won't even consider free over nonviolent crimes. But you will trade an arms dealer for a WNBA player? Wow. This is crazy. Or I'll take it a step further. You will pardon Little Wayne, Kodak Black. Oh, it's a few more. I can't think off the top of my head. How many of them have been pardoned? But we cannot free our political prisoners who have served decades in jail unjustly. This is a happy day for the Griner family, but actually this is a sad day day for America. Wow. It's just like America 
never cease to amaze me with the double standard. But I don't know. I don't want to talk on this long, but I just thought it would be food for thought. But hey, tell me what you think about this video. Hey, I'm just asking.